In this video, we will demonstrate how to use the Keithley Kickstart 2 Software Data Logger app to remotely configure scan channels and view and manage data. To select an instrument, select the appropriate instrument icon and drag it towards the center of the screen. Then select the Data Logger app and press OK. Once the app is open, you can add channels to a scan by clicking the check box next to the channel number. This will open the channel settings screen. You can here you can select a function, which then opens the settings applicable to that function. From this settings screen, you could also apply custom channel labels to the channels. And then pr press save settings. We'll set channel 102 to measure two wire resistance, channel 103 to measure temperature, and channel 104 to measure DC voltage. In the flow chart on the left side of the screen, you can see all of the channels included in the scan as well as their associated measurement functions. Double-clicking any of these blue blocks will reopen the channel settings for that channel. Towards the bottom of the screen is the scan settings. We will set the scan to start on channel limit with our pre-scan channel as 101. We will set our high temperature limit to 30 degrees Celsius and our low temperature limit to 25 degrees Celsius and then hit Save Settings. Channel 101 is now acting as our pre-scan monitor channel. This means that until the temperature of the DUT reaches within the limits of 25 and 30 degrees Celsius, a scan will not trigger. But once it is between those limits, the scan will trigger. To run the scan, simply click the Run button. Down here, is the scan progress bar. It will show how close the scan is to completion. To view the readings on a graph, open the graph tab. Here you'll find all of your readings over time separated by units. To view the readings in the table, open the table tab. From the table you can rename channels and also hide data that has not yet reached stability. To hide data, simply highlight all of the unwanted data, right click, and select hide. Returning to the graph tab, we can see that all of the unwanted data is now hidden. This completes our brief overview of using pre-scan monitor feature in Kickstart along with the DAC 6510.